With this week's Cardiology Countdown, I'm actually going to highlight three new features on Cardiosource. Now, at the number three spot, I have the inaugural launch of Expert Opinions. And actually, this is a relaunch, as we used to always have them, but in the newly configured Cardiosource, we didn't include them. They have been part of the two communities, the biomarker and atrial fibrillation communities, where we ask experts in the field to give their opinion about hot topics. And we're now bringing that back to Cardiosource. And so it's a new feature. We have one that Jeff Moses and colleagues have done uh, on TAVI, uh, that is the aortic valve uh, stent implantation. Uh, and so uh, this will start a new feature on Cardiosource uh, moving forward. At the number two spot this week, I want to highlight the new search engine on Cardiosource. It is a very powerful new engine that helps categorize all the different types of articles and features within Cardiosource. And so if, for example, you uh, searched uh, door to balloon time, um, or more broadly, STEMI, or mitral valve guidelines, it will search through all of Cardiosource and categorize into the different categories. And so on the upper left, you'll see the different categories, as shown here, where you have guidelines and JAK articles, JAK imaging or intervention articles, as is relevant, and expert opinions, trial summaries, and all the different types. So you can narrow down to find exactly what you're looking for. It's a very powerful tool, and, and I've certainly enjoyed using it and want to uh, point this out to you. It looks the same simple search across the top, but it's now a very powerful uh, search engine. Now, this week's number one spot is Cardiosource Mobile. Um, we have two big mobile resources. One, I think, that you may be aware of, the Jack iPad Edition, is a wonderful way to read Jack and have links to uh, enhanced content, so to speak, of uh, having videos that are related to the Jack articles and uh, slides uh, that the authors have uh, prepared in a Jack template. Uh, in addition, other related journal scans, guidelines, trial summaries, etc. Um, the new Jack iPad edition also allows you to email PDFs um, of articles from Jack uh, or slide sets and, and other content. So uh, a great way to read Jack in the summer, be it on the beach, uh, in a hammock, um, uh, a terrific uh, new approach to, to Jack. And then there's also now Cardiosource Mobile that has all of the uh, features or most of the features from Cardiosource uh, with the Cardiosource video news, such as this one, uh, as a constant feed, has all the journal scans. It has all of the abstracts to all three of the Jack journals, and it can actually link through to the web page on your iPad or iPhone. Uh, and um, so this is really a terrific way to get all the different parts of Cardiosource in the mobile app. Uh, and so I encourage you to look in the mobile resources section and download uh, the apps, and um, it should be a great new way to get all of the latest cardiology information. So for this week's Cardiology Countdown, I'm Chris Hannon.